Hello everybody, I hope you're having a great day. In this lecture, we will be covering PSPs and how I use them in my trading. So let's get right into it. So basically, a PSP is just a reversal signature, but instead of using SMT per se with highs or swings, you use it with that body of a candle. So as you see here on NQ, on this hourly chart, this candle right here printed as a down close candle and this candle right here with ES printed as a up close candle. You pair this with narrative and other logic and now this is used as a form of bearish SMT. It is just another way of identifying a craft in correlation, right? Let's look at this example. So as you see here, we have this bearish PSP here on NQ. And NQ goes, trades near that PSP, which would be somewhere in proximity of this candle, then forms its bearish chain of state of delivery, and then starts to reverse and trade away. Now I'm going to show you a couple examples on a live chart. All right, so now we're here on a 15 minute chart. On the left is NQ, in the middle is ES, and on the right is YM. As you see, this 1015 candle right here is a up close on the NASDAQ and ES, and on YM it is a down close. So this is a PSP, and with bearish narrative, I want to see price now trade away from this PSP. And if we play forward, as you see, price ends up expanding lower. I'm going to show you a bullish example. Now here's a bullish example. On NQ, you see this candle right here is a down closed. This candle right here is an up close, and so is on YM. Paired this with narrative and use this as a bullish PX PSP to frame that price wants to now expand higher. And if you see, price ended up expanding higher. Thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed and learned something from this video.